Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori in Wellington. And I've got a keto haul for you today. Now these are some keto foods that I found at two separate stores. First, Costco, and second, Big Lots. We cannot be sleeping on Big Lots, friends. Um, so I wanna show you a few things I picked up. It's not everything, but this is a good variety of what I picked up the, this week for my house. Okay, first we're gonna start with Costco. I found these no sugar bars. These are keto bars. They're a little higher in carb than I typically like, but they are a great on the go food. And you get eight peanut butter bars and four chocolate fudge brownie bars. They are three net carbs. I don't typically net carbs, but again, I always look for things for on the go. So this would be a whole meal for me. And the whole box of bars, like 12 bars, was $9.99 at Costco. So I grabbed that this week and I just put them in my pantry. Um, this is the sweetener I've been getting at Costco. This is Erythritol Monk Fruit Blend. I use this in my coffee in the morning. This is, I think, $9 or $10 if I had to guess. I can't remember off the top of my head, but you get in here. 32 ounces or two pounds of sweetener. And I can use one of these about a month, month and a half for my coffee. So I grabbed one of those and I like to stay stocked up. So you'll see in a second. Um, this I Know Foods brand, I really enjoy. Um, this is Keto Granola. It has for a third of a cup, it has eight carbohydrates, one sugar alcohol. So seven carbohydrates three fiber. It is made with pecans, pumpkin seeds, almonds, hemp seed, sunflower seed, and coconut. And I love this. Just a snack on. I grab just a little handful of it or I put it in coconut milk. But again, it's something different. <laughs> My LinkedIn is being so weird. It's something different to have. Costco does have um, a couple keto cereals. Um, this is the one I chose to get. This time I got two bags of it. So this will last me a couple months. I'm hoping actually that it lasts me to March when I go to Canada so I can bring some with me because it's really good on yogurt. So I grabbed a bag of that. I also grabbed a bag of these. I don't, this cereal I think was $9.99 and you get 22 ounces, but it's a lot. It's very filling cereal. Um, this bag of 14 ounces is chocolate keto, and they come individually packaged in these little bat in these little packages. Each package has six carbohydrates, and uh, I think the sugar is what's my sugar here? Butter, low fat, cocoa, organic cane. There is a little cane sugar in here, um, but it's not too bad. So I only eat these as a treat. So I like that they are portion control because I can just eat one square of chocolate. And it's, I can open this up and show you. So I just take one of these and it's sea salt. It's dark chocolate sea salt and there's four little squares in here, but this is a perfect little treat for me. After dinner in the evening with some coffee. And I don't eat all of this every day. It's just stuff that I have on hand to stay on track. And then the last thing I got were these Hilo brand, um, Hilo Life. These are, I call them Keto Ritos. They are Doritos made with almond flour. So they are keto friendly. Um, one ounce or 14 chips has five carbohydrates. They also have nine protein. Now, again, not something I eat on the regular, but you get 12 servings in this bag. And though it is $8 for a bag of these chips. Unfortunately, convenience foods are not cheap, but I, it's a give and take for me. I need to have some things on hand and I also make a lot of my own food. So this was what I got at Costco. I know I got a couple other things, but that's the main things I bought at Costco. Then I went to Big Lots. Now Big Lots is around, I think they're national. And I typically check out their food section. 
you just never know what they're gonna get, right? And it is the first of the year, so I, I did a good, pretty good haul. I grabbed these, the brand is, or they're called Sucker Punch. These are kosher style. Our pickles pack a punch, knockout flavors, fresh packed, 11 spices, no sugar. There's no sugar in the brine for this. These were $4.99 for a jar of kosher dills. They also had them in just pickle flavor, like regular pickle, and then they had bread and butter, which then would have your um, sugar in it, but this is kosher. There's a big old chunk of pickled garlic at the bottom, which I can't wait to get to, but I needed some pickles. So I grabbed a big jar of this, and this has 24 fluid ounces. So I grabbed that. Um, I get these at Costco, sometimes Parm Crisps, the brand. This is a party mix. So it has um, cheese wisps, it has cashews, almonds, pistachios oh it's right here almonds cashews pistachios and parm crisp and these are in a flavor of barbecue uh five carbohydrates quarter of a cup serving there's about six servings in here i've already busted into those because i was hungry um and then again on the snack front this was a good deal this brand, it's called Bake Believe Dark Chocolate, No Sugar Added. They had it in milk chocolate and dark chocolate. And the sweetener in here is stevia. They're sweetened with stevia. One square has five carbohydrates. So again, it's all about portion control at this point. But these were 99 cents a bar. So I grabbed four bars to have because again I can do one square let's do our thumbnail um I can do one square put a little peanut butter on it and that's a treat but at 99 cents a bar I would tell you the other chocolate that I really like is Lily's it's l-i-l-l-y apostrophe s and that is four dollars a bar also same sweetened with stevia so this was a great deal. So I grabbed four bars just to keep on hand. I mean, these are good until April 17th and May 20, May, April and May. So I've got plenty of time to consume these before the best buy date. Um, also Parm Crisp brand, and this would be a size that I would get at Costco as well. This was only $8.99. I feel like at Costco, they were $12.99 for these. But this is, it's just baked cheese, and this has everything but the bagel seasoning and mixed in with it, and it's really good. Like, something to have if I'm having a rolled piece of chicken for lunch or a piece of rolled lunch meat with cheese and a couple palm crisps, and that's lunch. So, again, this is all conven convenience foods. I don't eat it every day. I just wanted to give you an idea of some things we could find out in the wild. But this is palm crisp. I really like these brand, $8.99, and you get 9.5 ounces. And then the last thing I picked up was some sweetener. Now, this is uh, Lakanto Monk Fruit. I used to buy this bag at Costco for like $10, and it was $10 at Big Lots. My Costco has not had this in months. My Costco... Excuse me back there. My Costco switched over to this brand. It's the same stuff. The monk fruit is 28 ounces for Lakanto, and this Volupta is two pounds. So this is the better buy. So I'm not mad about it, but I also like this, and I grabbed this before I went to Costco, and just in case Costco was out, um, because I use this for everything. This is my sweetener of choice. Eight carbohydrates, but there's also eight sugar alcohols, and I don't count the sugar alcohols, so this is zero carbohydrate for me. And then they have golden, which is a brown sugar, and again, eight and eight. Um, but I use this more for baking. If I'm gonna make a keto cookie or something for like a brown sugar, I get these little bags. Typically, I would get them at like TJ Maxx, Marshalls carries this brand, um, but yeah, for $3.50. They had a bunch of keto stuff in stock at my big lots this week, so I grabbed these items to just stock my pantry. It's nothing I have to eat today or tomorrow, 
This sweetener is good until 2024. And that's just the best buy date. Yeah, these are both good until, or the best buy is both till 2024. The best buy on this is October. So I'm good for a very long time with snacks. I'm probably, when I go on my retreat, I'm gonna get a bag of these. I'm trying to find the best buy. This is good, best buy July. I, these will not make it until July. But I will be bringing a bag of these with me to when I go to my retreat. And I'm also bringing my tuna pouches with me. Lunch, a pouch of tuna and a couple chips and that's lunch. So good to have on hand and it's good for me to stay focused. These are Best Buy, I mean, I just bought these so they should have a pretty, these are Best Buy December of 2022. And you get, for $10, you get 15 servings. And each serving is two of these. So you get 30 of these in this bag. And I only eat one, which is three carbs. So this is a really nice treat for me to have on hand. And it's prepackaged, which is what I like about these. So that I don't over, you know, overeat myself. So I will bring these with me as well when I go on my retreat. God willing. Come on, Canada. Um, so a lot of this stuff will go like, I'll bring a little bit of this with some too good yogurt. I will have a refrigerator in my room. I'll show you the food I'm bringing, but for breakfast, it'll probably be a little bit of granola and yogurt. The three mornings that I'm there, lunch will be tuna pouch with some of these chips and dinner. I will probably bring like trail bologna and cheese and that's fine for me. And then if we choose to go out to eat, that is okay too. I just want to be prepared. And for me to stay on my healthy eating plan, I can't be ordering Uber Eats or whatever the version is. So for me, it's better to be prepared and then take some stuff home if I need to than it is to depend on ordering out. So that's it. I want to share with you some different hauls and where I've been getting my keto food because it definitely is de at newer and better stores and places that I hadn't seen it in the past. All right, hope you enjoy. I will talk with you later.